most important question of integration. Let us see the question. Find integration of x cos x. So for this type of question, we can solve very easily by integration by parts. So integration by parts, we are integrating the two factor, two multiple you can say. So we will use which function, one function as a first and other as a second. So which function first and which function second, so just check it the rule. This is I let, I L A T E. So I means inverse function, logarithmic function, algebraic function, trigonometric function and exponential function. So you can go first, second, third, fourth. So here x cos x. So x is what? Algebraic function and cos x is what? Trigonometric function. So algebraic is first and this is second. Now rule is what? So leave the first function integration of second. That is what? Cos 6 dx minus integration derivative of first function that is dy dx of x into integration of second. So integration of second that is what? Cos 6 dx and again integration of whole. So you know integration of cos 6 is what? So integration of cos 6 is what? That is integration of cos is what? Sin x. So we can write x sin x minus integration derivative of x is what? That is the 1. Integration of cos x is what? That is sin x dx. So this is x sin x and integration of sin x is what? Minus cos x. So minus minus plus. So we'll get what? Plus cos x and plus c constant of integration. So this is our correct answer. Let us see the question. Here question is find integration of log x dx. So we know derivative of log x is what? 1 by x. But integration log x we don't know. So for finding the integration of log x simple technique is what? We will use integration by parts. Integration by parts we integrate the two multiple, two product. So here only one number given log x. So from ourselves we will use one. So we can write this integration of log x into 1 dx. Now you know the format I let. So this is inverse function, logarithmic function, algebraic function, trigonometric function and exponential function. So here logarithmic function given and algebraic function given. So this is the first function and this is the second function. So integration by parts is what? So leave the first, so left the first function that is log x and integration of second that is what? 1 dx minus integration of what? derivative of first function so d by dx of what that is log x and into integration of second that is one day and integration of whole so you know this is the integration of one dx so integration of one is what that is x to the power zero d so x integration of one is what x so we will write x log x and minus derivative of log x is what one by x so integration of 1 by x, integration of 1 dx is x dx. So this x and x cancel. So we know this is what x log x minus. This is the 1 dx integration of 1 dx is x plus c. So our correct answer is x log x minus x plus c is our right answer. Let us see the question. Find integration of x into e x dx. So here integration of two product x and ea so we will use here integration by parts so which part we which product we make first function and which one second so there is a certain rule rule is what that is i let this is i l a t e so this i is inverse l logarithmic a algebraic t trigonometric and e exponential so here x is what algebraic and this is what exponential so algebraic is first and exponential is second. This is the first step. Now integration by parts rule is what? So leave the first function. So left this first function and integration of second function minus integration of what? Derivative of first function that is derivative of x. x into integration of second that is integration of ex dx and whole of integration. So we know integration of ex is what? ex only. 
so we will write here x into ex minus integration derivative x is 1 into ex dx so again we can write x ex minus integration of ex ex plus c so this is our correct answer